what to say when your younger sister graduates college. It's a big moment, a culmination of about 17 years of schooling. But that big moment is not why I'm proud of you. It's all the little moments before. That piece of paper you got is very cool, and I can't wait to see where you hang it. But the more impressive things I saw that day were your friends that drove halfway across this big-ass state to support you. Your best friend's family coming to say congrats. And how you were one of only two people I saw that jumped into the river. Thank God you still have both your knees. I've heard that being a little sister is tough, but you did it. You carved your own path, you made your own friends, you built your own life. That is what makes me proud, more so than the piece of paper. You'll be getting a lot of advice about managing your money, about doing well at a job, about how to maximize your 5 to 9 after your 9 to 5. Well, I say, listen to those things because they're important. But this is the time to set your foundation for your life again. Keep that mindset you had when you first went to college, meeting and maintaining friends, exploring new hobbies, and finding ways to make the days more enjoyable than they were before. Money comes and goes. Your job will drop you in an instant if it's in their best interest. And maximizing your five to nine is code for become the perfect capitalist machine. You've successfully done it before, and I know you'll do it again. Carve your own path ahead. Do it in your own Megan way. Just know that we are right behind you. I'm right behind you. And I'm rooting for you. Love you, Maggie. Congrats.